My name is Maria Corpus. I am a local lover. I support local, I love local, I love creating spaces in our local community here in Omaha. Walking through the different rooms, of course, everyone loves a good neon light. And so then I saw that I was like, oh wait, that neon light is turning on and off, but part of it is still up and, oh, let's immigrant to migrant. and. There's so many complexities in just a word and two letters flashing on and off that bring up a lot of different experiences and feelings for me. To me, as my dad is an immigrant, so I, I find a lot of pride. I had a lot of pride growing up, like, yes, we are an immigrant family. And I think especially in the last six to seven years, that term has kind of been rubbed in the dirt a bit. And language is, is just so powerful. And... Yes, I can still be proud to be an immigrant, but I can also put respect on it for other people who have a different story than me. This book is the like the oldest and longest living statement from the United States on immigrants. It's just it's really sad that we still refer back to this mindset um, that was scripted so long ago. Like I understand there needs to be a base, there needs to be a place where we start but I think that so often we just get stuck well this is just the way it's been and there's no room for flexibility or improvement um, and so that felt really disheartening a lot of us it's very common for people to have an immigration story uh, I'm I'm privileged and lucky enough to to have my dad and my Lola still alive to tell me that story, but there is many folks whether they're black and were brought over on slave ships and don't they don't know where they're from, or they were already here. They're Native Americans who were already here to begin with, um, but also listening to their creation stories, and all the different tribes have their own creation stories, and I just think the more that we're able to speak our stories that live in our bodies, the more we can wring out that ancestral trauma and the more space that we can create for having empathy for ourselves and our family lines and for our neighbors as well. Mm -hmm.